What's going on everybody, Finn here from Finn Faiths and today we're going to check out another liquid by EcoFave today and that is going to be the liquid which is Mother's Milk. Well, to be precise, well, wow, I just realised actually that light is a bit bright on white. Let's get out the brightness, can we get out the brightness? There we go. So this is EcoFave's Mother's Milk. But it's actually changed its name to Mills Milk on the website and the bottle itself. So we've opened the bottle up anyhow. They do in a zero three and six milligrams of nicotine content, and the ratio in the PG and the Fiji is Fiji is ninety, so it's quite high in relation to the Fiji, and it is ten only, obviously, in the PG. But it is designed for sub tanks and drip juice, as they advertise it as drip and juice. So the box itself is pretty neat. Obviously, I've had to rip open the top, so to speak, to get into it. But it is nice. It's like a little, a little milk bottle. The only problem is because it's really dark in this room at the moment. The light which I use to kind of record with is very bright when it comes to things to white. I've got to kind of hide it as such. Just kind of get it out of the imagery so you can really see it. But as you can see, it's a woman swaddling a baby, and the baby's got a nice little smile. He's like, "Yeah, I'm getting something there." And on the side, it's got this like kind of like missing kind of package, and it just says missing in here: tar, carbon monoxide, formaldehyde, ammonium, hydrogen cyanide, arsenic, DDT, and that is all the rubbish and junk you get in from smoking cigarettes, which is pretty nice. Thanks for putting that on the box. So, enough of the little packaging. Let's chuck that over there. This is what it's all about: the bottle, the 30 ml bottle. So the 30 ml bottle is nine pound ninety nine. You can get it on their website, which is eco-fip.uk. But there's no description whatsoever on the flavours on any of the juices, which is quite strange. And I thought the word, but the bottle's pretty straightforward. The packaging, the design of it overall is fantastic. But as you can see, it says on there, Mills milk, and that's what it is. So I don't know because milk is basically man my life to fuck. I don't know if it's basically because of that. And they've had to change the packaging on the front. Not too sure. Oh, this is probably the old box which it's now coming in. But overall. Let's have a look at it, because I really, really like their cookies and cream, so I thought, hey, everyone's going on about mother's milk and stuff these days, so let's check out what it is. So the pictures on it basically shows, as an illustration, custard cream biscuits and strawberries, so let's have a smell of it. Anyways, we'll give it a quick shake anyhow, and then get the smell out. So when you smell it, it's got a weird smell to it. You could definitely smell strawberries in there, but it's not too strong. It's kind of a weird smell, strawberry, which I was hoping of a really rich, fruity strawberry smell. But you can smell hints of vanilla in there as well. But not so much biscuits. It's a really, really strange. It's kind of like it wants to be strawberry, but it's not quite there, strawberry, which it's not an unpleasant smell, but it's, it is a strange smell. But that just might be my nose in general. Other people might get a stronger smell of strawberry. Now, where did that top come? Because it's got a nice little. Oh, it's on there. It's got a nice little kind of shell top. But the bottle, it's, it's pretty fantastic. The bottle, it's pretty good. So, we filled up the Kanga sub tank. We want a 0.5 coil, 4.2 volts. And we're going to fave it on 25 watts and see how well it does. So, because it's a high VG, I'm expecting it to blow pretty much in clouds. It does. It smells weird. It's kind of like. In relation to the smell, it's definitely it smells like if you get the custard creams, but can you remember when they done the limited edition custard cream? The strawberry one, and it was kind of it was very sweet strawberry-ish and it didn't really work too well. That's kind of what it smells like, and I'm hoping it's not like that, but let's have a try. So cloud production is fantastic. It definitely chucks out clouds. But there's not a massive amount of taste to it. So, in relation to flavour, it's 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 a bit plain compared to, let's say when we tried cookies cream, I was in love with it, it's not bad, I could definitely favour it, got no throat hit whatsoever, no irritation of the nose or anything like that, but in relation to flavour, you can taste custard cream afterwards, kind of like sitting in your mouth, just sitting there and you can, like if you've eaten it and it definitely has that biscuity taste, but strawberry, it's there, but it's not there, and I'm quite disappointed on the flavour. I was expecting a lot of kind of nice, fruity, juicy kind of flavour coming through there, nice, creamy, rich flavour. But the strawberry, it's kind of not strawberry. It's hard to explain. I'm
And see, it's, it's not a bad product at all. It's not a bad liquid. You could favour it all day. I could favour it all day. But if you have to something with more strawberries and things, more of a kind of cream sized strawberries with cream, like fresh strawberries and cream, kind of favour. This is something totally different because it's going more for the biscuit kind of taste. So, kind of upset in the way that it's not that strawberry. It's kind of like an artificial strawberry taste. But, like I say, it leaves a nice kind of a nice custard cream taste in the mouth which comes on the back end which I don't mind at all so there you go that is Mel's Milk as they call it by Eco Fape well, basically Mother's Milk which you can actually get 30 mils and they do it in a 100 mil bowl but definitely go check it out for yourself if you're looking for that kind of flavour give it a try you never know if somebody's got it ask them for a try but until then thank you for watching another faping review remember get rid of the stinky sticks the tall bloody things just chuck them in the bin it is coming up to stop October well Stop Toba, I believe as they call it. Get rid of it. Go to Fabian. Fabian's the cool way. It's healthier. Till then, see you all later. Bye.